And good afternoon, it's Kurt Aaron. I just want to update you on what's going on with the storms. We've been getting some calls here in the weather office, so I thought we'd just jump on social media real quick and show you what's going on. So uh, good Sunday afternoon to you. I hope you're having a very nice weekend. It's certainly been hot and it's feeling a lot more like summer, but here's the radar and notice what's happening here. The front itself is still west of our region, but out ahead of that front, we're getting prefrontal showers breaking it up. I'm gonna put it on the now cast and let's go ahead and zoom in now. We are under a severe thunderstorm watch. We don't have any warnings in our viewing area. There are some just south of us, but that doesn't mean these storms can't be nasty. I mean, look at this. Let's start up here in the northern tier, Montrose. There is a tremendous amount of cloud to ground lightning with these storms. So if you live in the Montrose, Dimmick, Hartford area, Great Bend, get ready. They're moving in your direction and there's gonna be more forming as we head through the afternoon. We come down, you'd see a little rain there in Factoryville, Dushore. And there's also storms forming right now in central Pennsylvania. They're over the Bloomsburg area, Berwick, uh, Benton, get ready. Some downpours there as well. And then if you look out west near Milton, Lewisburg, there's some showers and thunderstorms. And then down here in our southern tier, these are moving pretty quickly to the northeast. So let's go ahead and just give you an idea where this one's going to be heading. And here we go. You can see Pine Grove at 408, Pottsville at 429, and uh, West Brunswick at 436 so that is heading in that direction let's go up north here just a little bit more and we'll focus on a few of these that we have and just bear with me because we're doing this uh, live so there's there's another system and i want to put it into motion for you so you can kind of see for yourself they're they're moving about 35 miles an hour to the east and they're moving east northeast so you see that that movement so that means when, when you look at this on the now frame like right here you would think, oh, that's coming right at Hazleton, but it's actually moving in this direction like this. So yes, Hazleton will get some, but that'll be from these that are down here. So here's a couple of spots, Buttonwood, Wooksbury, Pittston. Here's another spot. There's Shepton, Sugarloaf, Hazleton. Um, you can see the times there. So uh, you wanna be careful if you're gonna be heading out. Uh, I mentioned a couple of severe thunderstorm warnings just to our south. There they are down towards the Harrisburg area. And our whole region, we're just under that severe thunderstorm watch right now. But as I mentioned, those storms will get uh, pretty nasty here as we move through the afternoon. So we're going to talk with our producer, Zoe, and we're going to go ahead and lead with weather at 6 o'clock. So if you're looking for more information and you, you, know, you want to watch it on TV, we're going to have much more on the weather. But just a quick overview and an update. Uh, this gives you an idea of the storms that are out there. And again, all of us are going to encounter this. If you're working outside or you know somebody that's working outside, especially that one down there near uh, Millersburg and Halifax, this one right here, I'm a little bit concerned about this one. This is the one that spawned the severe thunderstorm warning and it's just south of our region. But you folks in Schuylkill County, Higgins, Tower City, uh, this looks like it's heading in your direction. As you can see by the icons there, it is packing some cloud to ground lightning and some hail. And when you get those pink in the radar like that, those are torrential downpours pretty heavy. So just bringing you an update, letting you know what's happening this afternoon in case you haven't encountered one of those storms. They are going to continue moving to the east. And then later on tonight, the front itself will come through. So we got kind of two rounds to deal with. We're dealing with the first round now. So we just want you to be safe. If you know of somebody that's working or playing outside, especially if they're like mowing lawns or using any kind of machinery, they won't be able to hear the thunder. So you want to give them a heads up. Hey, there's some severe weather possible this afternoon and early this evening. We'll continue to update you. Uh, if it should warrant, we'll go ahead. Maggie's here with me on the assignment desk. We'll go ahead and jump back on the uh, social media uh, genre. But if, if it doesn't warrant, no tornado warnings, then we'll go ahead and just wait for our 6 p.m. programming. But we wanted to give you a heads up for this afternoon. Thanks for watching.